Hello guys, today I'm here with a new tutorial, and in this video I'm gonna show, how to backup and restore data using Time Machine. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please go and subscribe to our channel and stay connected for latest updates. So guys let's start. For this purpose you will require, an external hard drive or SSD, equivalent to your current data size, or more than that. As of now, I'll be using 1TB external drive. Before proceeding further, I'll just create few folders in different directories. Now, plug your external drive, and as you can see, the drive appeared here. Now, I'll quickly format the drive, however it's not required for the process. Now, open System Preferences, and open Time Machine. And here, click on Select Backup Disk, and select your external drive. Check the box of Encrypt Backup, to encrypt your backup. After selecting the drive, click on Use Disk. Now, backup will automatically start in 120 seconds. And as you can see, backup process has been initiated, it will take time depending on your data size. Time Machine Backup has been done. Close the pane. Now, I'll delete all the folders created, and then we'll restore from Time Machine Backup. I'll also remove recent item from doc. Now, open Migration Assistant. Click on continue and enter your password. By default Time Machine Backup has been selected. Click on continue. If you're using laptop, connect to power source and click on continue. Make sure that your drive is plugged, and it will appear in a while. Now, select the Time Machine drive and click on Continue. If you want to restore your previously created backup, then expand it, select the backup you want to restore, and then click on Continue. Select the information you want to transfer, and click on Continue. Set password for your Mac. Choose the user option you want to continue with and click on continue. Click on authorize and enter your password and then click on continue. And now, the restore process is initiated. It will take time, depending on your data size.
restore process is done, click on restart now. Migration is completed, click on Done. Sign in with your Apple ID, or skip it. And now, you can see all the deleted items are back. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you have any question, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and for more updates stay connected and have a great day.